After almost three years, I'd finally made it up to see my friends. Before I could even say hello, Lance sucker punched me in the nads. Cheers, mate. But it was so good to see these guys' faces again. Instantly, it was like old times again. The last time I saw these two was October 2020. After our lockdown camp and all of the madness had settled, we'd all realised that living the van life was all well and good until there's a global pandemic and that England can be extremely inhospitable. When I hopped over the channel and travelled 1500 miles south to Portugal to find my off-grid base, these guys were doing the same, in fact almost identical mileage, but north to Sweden. We'd kept up on WhatsApp and the old live stream, and seen as me and Ash both make videos, we'd seen what each other were up to, but man was it good to see this place in the flesh. We tried getting the van backed into the guest bay and out the way, but the ground wasn't having any of it. Even with the waffle boards, I might as well be parking on a creme brulee. So for tonight, I'd just leave the van on the drive, taking some of their lawn with me. And of course, there was one more reunion, Lance and Bolski. Oh. Oh. These two were inseparable during our trips and adventures. But being dogs, we weren't sure if they'd remember each other. But they definitely did. Poor Bolski's back legs have started to fail him, but barring that, it was just like old times for them too. You two having a wee off, eh? This is his house. Not happening. Not happening. Oh, Lance, stop jumping on everyone. Let's bring us. After a quick and excitable natter, we got down to delivering the goods. most difficult. We struggled. We struggled. Uh, Bob, not to you directly, but it will benefit you. Your van's life giver. You've got a lot of gravy and cheese. Oh, yeah, my brother bought me them. Let me go get a You're home. That's right, Bjorn and Ingrid are the barn's new power station. Where Ash already had their name tags ready. Oh, you're going to be so happy to see them. <laughs> <laughs> the band's lifting. Oh, right, this one was front. Are they heaven? <laughs> <laughs> and there was many other items crammed into every nook and cranny of the van. More there's so much stuff, isn't there? Oh, Well, the gravy and the tea bites are from my brother. Let's have a night! Come on in. I've got an empty Lance's cupboard. This reminds me of just... Fun times! Fun times! Yeah, man. Oh, God, you have really buried it. Oh yeah, yeah. it's like empty the whole cupboard. I love those times. Mm. Smuggling whiskey. Not a problem. <laughs> oh, no, no. <laughs> Where's it rolled off to? <laughs> In down your mouth? I think James gave me two years ago. It's been rolling around for a while, I'm afraid. Oh my Sorry, God, imagine James. If it, imagine if it cracked and leaked all out. Why does it smell of great whiskey? Oh, Thank you. Very good. <laughs> it does. <laughs> Sign it. Oh my god. Delivered. With everything oh. delivered, the guys took me around for a tour, and before we knew it, it was night. So I sat upstairs in the barn conversion to really catch up. None of which was filmed. I felt pretty bad I'd come in cameras blaring video mode on arrival. So for tonight, everything was put away, and it was just for us three and the dogs. Last night the ground froze solid, so this morning we could get my van parked where we'd failed last night. Right, 
and this would be where the van's living for a little while, seen as come midday it'll have sank. The morning light revealing the other two members of the van clan. the snow, he just has never really had that much of it. Mm. He had to eat it in his trip. And then up the Alps. Oh, that be shit to get home. It's my usual morning alarm. Yeah, we got up a little bit earlier this morning. Um, one, so I could refilm the entrance. That wasn't me originally coming in. Um, I got too excited, just the drone flew off somewhere and I just left everything and said hi to these guys. Um, so I had to redo that. Are you enjoying that bit of park? And then we didn't park on where I am now last night because we needed it to frost um, and this morning it did. But yeah man, it's um, to be here is very strange. Very cool, but very strange. And I've seen it on the telly, if you like. Already the cold has put some electrical items out. Yeah, but to, to be here and see the place and just what Ash and Marie have achieved is insane. It really is insane. It's such a beautiful place and it's just so surreal. Like, uh, I was looking out the front window uh, last night we were just looking at a few bits <clears throat> and it's like I watched this window being fitted and I, I know this window but I've never been here it was yeah it's very very surreal which is fucking, what an awesome place we're just getting a coffee on each and then we're gonna go for a bit of a stroll around and get a, a lay of the land and then uh, yeah, from there, we don't, I don't know what's going on today. Just See if the van sinks, I have to try and prop it up. If you don't know where I am and what I'm talking about, uh, you need to get yourself over to Lost in Europe. And Marie as well, she's now set up a, a YouTube channel. But I'll leave links below. And um, if you like what I do, you will love what these guys do. Oh my God. Absolutely. Yeah, for me, it's just... Good to see my mates again. It's been three years. We had a, a long chat last night, a couple of beers and a, a whiskey. Good catch up. There is one missing member, and we're thinking about you, mate. But it's bloody good to be here. Ash took me and Lance for a stroll down the local tracks to get a feel for the area and establish morning and evening dog walks. Like our place, it's pretty out of the way and the tracks go on for miles. What's very different to our place is the fact that we're walking about a metre above the ground. Lance, as always, was loving the white stuff and this was the most he'd ever seen. Me, on the other hand, well, I still have to get my snow legs. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. 
We were heading towards the lake, which despite the change in weather was still frozen solid. It felt very unnatural to walk out onto a lake, but Ash assured me that even though it's half the thickness of the winter months, you can still walk on it, ride a snowmobile over it, drive, say, my van over it, even land a 747 on it. It's that strong. And there were snowmobile tracks all over it. We shot the shit here for a little bit and caught up while Lance bowled around like a madman. But one thing that became quickly obvious was despite the snow and ice everywhere, the coats we bought really weren't necessary. This was t-shirt and sunglasses weather. Once back at the barn, there was a couple of errands to run. So we hopped in the new Swedish mini beast and went a little further afield. Mini beast. Yeah, I do love this one. It's I cracking. Do, I want to do a lot more. It made so much sense when you got it. I was like, oh, yes. He's gone back to origin. Yeah, it's weird. I've got the same van it used to have. I've got the same bike it used to yeah. have now. <laughs> and now you've got my dirty laundry in it too. We got to the local campsite where the, uh, yeah, where where the washing machine was. Then to the local town shop that sold everything imaginable for supplies. Before we got back though, we stopped off into an old Swedish heritage site, an authentic old hamlet turned museum. It was out of season due to the snow, but that wasn't going to stop us. Just slow us down. We're good. Oh my God. <laughs> where am I going? What's the wall? That's a hay drive. Oh wow! Oh, yeah. No way. It makes sense. I really want to make something like this. Yeah. Gonna do like a perimeter boundary. Yeah. Like a grain store. Like, it's like a whole. This is just the one talk for that farm. Yeah. All the different little buildings. Yeah. That's the main hall. Yeah, I like it. Get this all off. Oh, it's cold. It's just all. The that is a view right there. Holy shit. These like cattle barns. I love this at home. There'd be British heritage sites on everything. Do not touch! Or they'd be vandalised. Or vandalised. Yeah, yeah. Spinning thing, isn't it? Man. The thing you'll notice as well. Is it all the doors and the ceilings and everything are so low because Swedish people used to be so much shorter. <laughs> no, this is a genuine thing. Yeah, look at that. Are you dripping on my back? Old oven in here. Oh, wow. Oh, this is cool. Now, it's a shame we're not, we can't go into the main building because we've just got everything in there. Yeah. All the different skills like fishing, carpentry, everything. And then they've got all the tools laid out, it's amazing. Oh, this is, uh, is that a smoker? Probably, yeah. Anyway. I love stuff like this. This yeah, is amazing in house. Imagine that heating up and holding the heat. Yeah. Oh, let's oh. put you back then. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Touch one thing. Bit of five me. <laughs> <laughs> Just goes like that barn out there. Oh, even that, look. That's Oh yeah. I mean, I'm alright. That's so that looks like some of a Disney film. Yeah, it does. It's so warm. cartoony. Yeah, Emperor's New Groove style. And the ship would probably go down. You can see there's a gap. Quite a gap under the floor. Oh yeah. So we can get it out, I guess. Yeah, it's all sort of leaning, isn't it? Mm. Maybe it's that bit. Scoop it all down and down mm. there. Oh, I can feel it fucking moving when you walk. <laughs> yeah, that one don't feel right. <laughs> Mine just dead. Oh my god. Ah, uh, missing Mozzie. Fuck off. Can you see the birch rolled under the roof there? That noise. Turkey getting fucked. 
that, for the next six months. Is that what you're going to hear? All day. God, beautiful place. I love the staining on the wood. Living in a place like that. Just oh, beautiful. Like the exposed wood, yeah. the walls and everything, it's just incredible. And like this isn't like a regal home, is it? It's just like your thing and yet you've got ornate around the the doors, the uh, wardrobe, the seats have you know got It's all well made, isn't it? Yeah. Everything's like proper. Tiger brand. Oh, the tobacco too. <laughs> they're solid and they're amazing and they'll last hundreds of years if they're looked after. Yeah, yeah. If you leave them, they're going into the ground. Three more of this. Oh, yeah. uh, we're not getting in. There's a frozen puddle on the door. Old fridge then. I think it'll be able to cafe doors open. Maybe mm -hmm. it's popped open. Yeah. Oh, it's the ghosts. Oh. Well, that puddle's got deep. Melted a lot today. Yeah, it is. Getting back to the barn was just a brief visit to swap vehicles and grab a trailer, as we had a wood run to do to stop the campfires. the timber guy used to move stuff around his yard was insane. I'd never seen one before, but they were all over Sweden. seen a lot of you sort of peeling yeah. in. But it's like, even when it's wet, because it's got oil in it, yeah, it's, it's got... just a natural fire lighter. It's like nature's way of burning shit. Yeah. It's quite the rarity. There we are. What, birch? Yeah. Yeah, I suppose. Pine and... I don't know what their native tree is. I think it... England's always like oaks and ashes and all that. Yeah, I can't think what the native tree is, but I know they give you seeds for free and um, council building. They're trying to bring them back. Just grab them burgers in a minute. Yeah. It doesn't seem it's like a dream or something. Yeah. Snap out of it. It's exactly the same for me. Reunited. Lance was still over in the field playing with snow. <laughs> and with it being so deep, he could do another one of his favourite things dig. But for the rest of us, it was sat round the first official fire back together letting the embers warm up so that we could cook over the flame once again. Go on, find it. <laughs> Through the glove. How is it? You're right. Welding gloves. Oh, really? Yeah, the handles. Right. Oh, shit. In the snow. <laughs> wow. Did you leave it in there? In car. Smell it. That's, that's, welding. that's probably my finger. No. Really <laughs> Excuse me, madam. You are top of my giant Swede. That's what I'm wondering. Did you use the ladder?
ten. What are we doing? Maybe I'll the box. Oh, hey, this could be Jez's chair. Yeah. What did you do? Sorry, I'm not a twat. Same. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a massive belly. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just have a look then. Pounds in England, also.